three professionals in a scientific race against time. Who will become the first to go from sample to genotype? Who will become? <laughs> from Shanghai, China, graduate student Su Lin Chang. From Heidelberg, Germany, principal investigator Dr. Otto Potzenhauer. From Venice Beach, California, lab technician Robbie Johnson. And they're off. And Otto Potzenhauer loses a kit out of the gate. Ron, what are our contestants working with today? Jim, our contestants are working with a variety of samples. Banana leaf, blood, mouse tail, corn, pine cone, some fingernails, and human hair. Su Lin Chang and Otto Potzenhauer have come very prepared for dealing with so many samples, as you can see with all their kits. Robbie Johnson, on the other hand, either has a trick up his sleeve or is a little unprepared because I'm only seeing one kit. I just don't know how he'll be able to extract DNA from all those samples with just a single kit. And there's Su Lin Chen, really working feverishly, adding her lysis solution and digestion enzyme to the mouse tail sample. And there's Otto Potzenhauer doing the same. Both are following a traditional protocol, which means they're going to have to wait for 16 hours as their sample incubates. Looks like Robbie Johnson is taking a more unconventional approach. Could set him back a little bit, he does look relaxed. Su Lin Chang loading her sample into the heating block. And there's Otto, right on her heels. Robbie Johnson finally seems to have joined the party as he adds lysis solution to his sample, and into the heating block it goes. And there's Otto, working away. He really does have nice form. Back over at Robbie Johnson's bench, he's added the stabilizing solution. Now he seems to be adding some kind of master mix. Ron, have you seen that before? No, I have not. This is apparently a brand new kit and a brand new protocol. Whoa! He's moving straight onto the thermal cycler. Incredible! And we'll be right back to find out where this goes after this quick break from our sponsor. That's totally awesome. Step one, that's step one plus real-time PCR system from Applied Biosystems. They're totally awesome. Perform standard PCR in less than two hours and fast PCR in less than 40 minutes. Totally fast. Totally easy. Totally awesome. Step 1 plus real-time PCR system is totally awesome, but totally does not explode. Explosions used to convey awesomeness only. Welcome back. We're now almost 50 minutes into our race. Su Lin Chen and Otto Potzenhauer are still working hard and fast. There's been a lot of curiosity from those two toward Robbie Johnson. And there he is. Unbelievable! Less than 50 minutes in, and Robbie Johnson, the lab tech from Venice Beach, California, says he's done. Our judges are on the scene to inspect the data. Do we have our SNP guru? <laughs> And there you have it, folks. Robbie Johnson is our new SNP guru. 